in this video, we will look at creating a workstation virtual machine using existing VMDK virtual disks. This video is based on VMware Knowledge Base Article 20101096. To create a workstation virtual machine using existing .vmdk files, click on File and then New Virtual Machine. Select Custom and click Next. Select the hardware compatibility you want and click Next. In the Guest Operating System Installation Selection screen, select I will install the operating system later and click Next. Select the Guest Operating System that you want to install and its version. Click Next. Provide a file name and choose the location where you want to save the virtual machine. Click Next. Adjust the number of processors and the number of cores per processor for your virtual machine. Click Next. Specify the amount of memory to be allocated to your virtual machine. Click Next. Select the desired networking type. Select the input-output controller type you want and click Next. Select Use an existing virtual disk and click Next. Browse and navigate to the location of your .vmdk file. Select the .vmdk file and click Next. It is worth noting that all child .vmdk files must be in the same location as the selected .vmdk file. You can now review the settings displayed in the summary window. If you want, click Customize Hardware and make any changes required. Click Finish. This concludes our look at creating a workstation virtual machine using existing VMDK virtual disks. For further tutorial videos, be sure to subscribe to our KBTV YouTube channel and our KBTV blog. Thank you for choosing VMware.